call it the Porsche of helicopters. And believe me, it is. Hey, so I got to introduce my buddy here, Dave Salem, who's the instructor over at MD Helicopters, trying to teach me how to fly a 500. How am I doing, buddy? Fantastic. Hey, welcome to the show. Appreciate it. When was the moment you knew you wanted to be a helicopter pilot? My dad was an Air Force helicopter pilot, so it, even as a little kid, I knew I wanted to be a pilot. You've had a great career, right? Oh, absolutely. I've been very blessed in my life and my career. And i got to tell you folks that Dave and I have flown together for 25 years, but we've never flown in the same helicopter. This is the first time we've flown in the same helicopter because he was in the PD department, Mesa PD in Arizona, and I was flying for Channel 3 in Phoenix, and we always talked on the radio, but we've never shared the cockpit. No, we haven't. So this is an absolute pleasure for me, Bruce. All right, buddy. Well, we'll go chop the throttle on me whenever you want. I'm ready to rock and roll. Thanks, Absolutely. man. Absolutely. So we're going to do some auto rotations. I'm putting this thing on the ground without the engine running, because I know you all want to see that. I tell guys, I don't teach you how to land in a Walmart parking lot. I teach you how to land in a Walmart parking space <laughs> because that's what you're going to need, right? What about Home Depot? Or Home Depot. So Dave, uh, how many are we going to do? Oh, as many as we can. Oh, we're going to be doing straight in autos, 180 autos, engine fares on takeoff, engine fares from a hover. You name it, we're going to be doing it. So it's down collective, aft cyclic. Okay, shoot, I've had a ninja ferry. Where am I going? Okay, I'm going to get there. All right, nose it over, get the RPM down. Everything's looking good. All right, I can now make my spot. Now, when the engine fails on a helicopter, you only have one chance. We're going to make sure that when you fly this thing, you're prepared to save your life if something happens. Right on. Biggest thing is don't have a get death grip on it. I, right. I don't Just think relax. you ever have. Yeah, relax, have some fun. Because you know what we get to do? We get to go do some models, brother. <laughs> I love it. I love it. <laughs> now keep an eye on Sneaky Dave's left hand as he chops the throttle on. Good. I'll kick it around. There you go. I just fly. Just like you're doing, man. Beautiful. There you go. Nice. Come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> awesome, man. Almost. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Dave promised me I'd be hitting that yellow spot by the end of my training. So to explain an auto rotation in simple terms, think about when the engine quits, the helicopter is going to descend, and the air rushing up through the blades keeps them spinning. Now that gives you lift to fly the helicopter to the ground and flare like a bird to land. Now I timed this auto you're watching and from the engine failure to landing was only 22 seconds. That's why we train to think fast and react. Heavy yeah, burst. Heavy There you go. Pick a spot, go to it. Going for the Home Depot right. parking spot. Airspeed's coming in, RPM's good. Good job. Hear that RPM? Right at the top. Love it. There you go. Now work it in. We're touching go. Beautiful. Level. Let it settle. Cushion. Four. <laughs> you promised. You promised by the end of the day, by the end of the training, we would hit the spot. Nice job at the bottom. Really nice, nice job. Let's do it again. Like you stole it. Can you 
imagine having to work for a living? <laughs> that would be such a drag. Oh.